Hey YouTube. Just made myself a cup of chaga tea. Chaga is a fungus. You can get it off of uh, birch trees. Most time you'll find it where birch trees are dying. Um, some of the easiest places to find it are wet areas. And then when the when the birch tree starts dying, um, chaga starts to grow on it. Basically what it looks like is burnt wood. And, you know, you've got your, you get, you get a nice white birch there. And, uh, and you look a lot of times in the crook, you'll see something looks like burnt wood. And there's what I mean. That's chaga. And it's not burnt. And when you take a look on the inside of it, it's like a brownish tan color. Chaga's been toted like one of the snake oils of modern day. It's good for just about anything. I'll let you look that up and decide. But uh, there's an awful lot of videos on what Chaga's all about. When you collect chaga, if you get the chance, uh, grind it up right away and put it somewhere to dry. Because what happens is when you take this and you let it dry, it becomes as hard as a rock. So to get it off, you know, it's it's a fair bit of work to To get any chaga off to make tea. Generally what I'll do is I'll just take a chunk or two or three chunks and then I'll put it in the water to steep. Uh, doesn't have a whole lot of flavor. Um, if you start drinking it for a couple of days I don't know if it's power of suggestion or not but I seem to have a little bit more alertness a little bit more energy but uh, you know if you want to try it try it it's up to you to decide do your research before you take anything and there you have it chaga thanks for watching see you next time